Hola amigos, I am Lorenzo from Broodminder and today I want to bring you with me through an inspection of all the hives. We are in the middle of a nectar flow of linden and also of chestnut. So the bees are very busy and I want to check the hives but I don't want to inspect physically all of them. So we will go through each of one, each of them, but through the bees up, okay? Before inspecting any hives, I want to show you this, the nectar flow index. We are in the middle of a great, great period. This is hot, this is, it is humid. And we have this great nectar flow index is 70%, 80% nearly, which is super high. Uh, we see here that we have the, the common lime 50% uh, flowering, max flowering. The common lime is this tree about there. And then it will stop the blooming in about a few days. But there are other trees around, okay? So very good period. And you will see it on the, on the scale measurements. So now we move to the hives and we will start with uh, this one, which is Mini Plus Blue. This is a small nook that I am using to raise queens. And since I knew there, were, there will be a, a big nectar flow, I added uh, a super. <laughs> On this nook and I did it right because as you can see here the productivity has been growing over the last 14 days and well it's making what it can make with this small colony but three kilos which is good uh, now we look to the brood and it started from a no queen because I removed the former queen and put a, a new uh, queen cell and so we see that in the meanwhile while they have been harvesting nectar they also have raised the queen and the brood is going up to the maximum so this one is great it's okay i don't want to touch it maybe the only thing to think about is adding an extra super if it was going still up again in the productivity this one is number two so let's take this one we see the brood is stable it's a high level brood now let's check the productivity Nice productivity too, five kilos uh, is okay. I mean, nothing to say on that one. Keep going. Number five. So number five has a, an even better productivity. Uh, and if we check the brood, it's going up, not very high brood. It's a, it's a former swarm. So it doesn't have the full box of brood. Maybe here I need to add a frame of uh, comb okay so one thing maybe to do this is number eight number eight great brood and what about the productivity ah no data so this one doesn't have a scale but as far as i see the brood is good and i remember it has it had enough space inside so still okay that one is number nine so number nine Great brood, no productivity because it hasn't scale, but this does well, nothing to say. This one is number six, 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 six here. Uh, okay, I have a cut in the measurements, but the brood seems it has been going up. And about the productivity is great. Seven kilos, I don't think they have filled the super yet. So we could check it, but I think it's fine. Uh, they can still enter another seven kilos. Number three, small productivity. Okay, what about the brood? Going up. So I think it's just raising brood. It was a small colony too, uh, so it's going up, but not producing very much. Okay, nothing to say. Uh, this one, number C, I won't touch this one. Number E, so this has been bringing nectar it doesn't have a, have a super 15 kilos. Well, maybe we need to move everyone to another hive because it's too much. What about the brood? Yeah. So it's in very good conditions here because it's a polystyrene hive and it has been just growing up. We need to move it to another bigger box. Now we move to the white one. So mini plus white has a important quantity of brood no scale here we should maybe try to see if yeah they are missing space with this quantity of brood 
uh, but I don't have any other super but I should yeah this should be checked maybe we need to move them that one is number four so this one typically has a problem with the brood it has been going down and it has been producing great but it has been going down with the brood so I don't like it we'll check it this one is number B RB 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 here so this is the opposite It's developing very well in brood and it has been bringing lots of nectar we have this super here so I think it's okay don't need to touch it and now we move to the last two ones so that one is RD also it has been producing not that as much as the other ones three kilos what about the brood stable 60 percent so okay not a high production but it's growing up and this one is number one number one number one same dynamics with the brood and what about the weight oh so it's not producing very much um that's tricky we should check it why is it so we will check it okay so here we are we have been systematically inspecting with the app all the 15 hives of this apiary uh, checking the brood and when it was available the weight and the productivity uh, those two magnitudes are helping us a lot to decide whether the hive is doing well or not and over the 15 hives we have selected four of them that need visual inspection that we will open to check uh, how they are going in some cases it was because they were rising up very quick in other cases because they have we had some suspicion of something going wrong uh, that's the four hives we will check for over 15 hives uh, because the idea as you understand it is not to go through all the hives systematically if they don't need it so we just we will just check those four ones and that's it uh, I hope it was helpful uh, I hope it was insightful and you uh, understand a little bit better how to run inspections with the data you get on the phone and the last thing is remember that every half counts <laughs>